I get a lot of questions from a lot of people in my life, and I'm sure you do as well. What does online woods class look like? And I think we've made the best of this situation. I've seen a lot of really sweet projects come in that you've been working on, whether it was kits that I put together for uh, for you, ukuleles, guitars, a couple beautiful guitars that you've made. Uh, I've seen lots of pictures of different organizers uh, for firewood that somebody has built. I've seen decks that people have worked on. I've seen projects in finished basements that people are working on. So great job getting out uh, from in front of the computer and building something with those hands. I know that this, this last term has, has gone different than probably any of us would have predicted, but I thank you for sticking with me. I know that my 17-year-old self in high school would have really struggled to stay on top of due dates and online class, all the things that go with losing the structure of school, and I would have struggled through that. And I know that there's probably a lot of you that were in that same boat that would not have wished this, that really struggled getting things done and having the motivation to do work instead of all those awesome distractions that we have at home. So thank you for pushing through this. As I look through grades this morning, both in Woods 1 and Woods 2, the vast majority of you are right on target. There are some of you that haven't done any of the at-home wood projects yet. If you've got any questions on those, please reach out to me. We need to get that taken care of as soon as possible because our grading window is closing. I want everything done by the end of this week, that's May 28th. I want all of your assignments turned in. That's going to give you an extra week if you look through the grade book and you see, shoot, there are some things I should have gotten done. Maybe it's already half done, just not turned in. I would encourage you to use that last week of time that, that I'm giving you to make sure both in Woods class and all your other classes that those things are taken care of. Uh, as far as seniors go, Seniors, especially in Woods too, because you've got projects in the wood shop. But if you know people that have been in wood shop, especially third term, you can pick your projects up. Um, Mr. Gangler sent out, Principal Gangler sent out a schedule for you to come and bring back textbooks and pick up Woods projects. All that stuff will be available for you guys to pick up by the loading dock, and there'll be directions for how to do that uh, in that email from Principal Gangler. So. Woods 2 students, come pick up your uh, Eurobox cabinet that you are most likely very near finished with. I'm going to be at school tomorrow getting those ready for you to get picked up. And I believe that it's next week that you guys can come and pick up your final stuff. There's a whole schedule out there. I don't have the dates remember, but I know that uh, Mr. Gangler has those dates set aside for you in an email sent just for you guys. Uh, don't be strangers. Come back and say hi. Even though, um, especially if you're a Woods 1 student, I've never met you. Uh, we've... We've met through videos a few times, and you've seen my beautiful face on video probably more than you wish. Uh, but I don't know anything about you other than what you've turned in, and that's a bummer. I, I really miss those connections that we were able to make. So don't be a stranger. Come on back to the wood shop. Stop by, say hi, take a look in the shop. There's some really interesting things there, and there's more equipment coming. There's two great big pieces of equipment that are getting delivered that I just found out. One is an automated edge bander that's going to be getting installed in the next couple weeks, and two is a, an automatic fence for our table saw. So those of that are in Woods 1, come on back and see that. If you're in Woods 2, come on back and say, wow, that's cool. I wish I would have had that when I was in class. Woods 2 students, come back for independent study if you want to build your capstone project. Woods 1 students, you can take Woods 1 again next year when we're back in school so you can get the experience you would have had. You'll be exempted from the safety stuff if you take Woods 1 again or Woods 2 again next year. Um, that way you can skip some of that safety stuff that you've done online and you can come back and start building stuff right away. Yeah, we, we missed you. Uh, hope you guys have a great end of the school year. Please don't hesitate to reach out if you've got questions. I'm here for you. Looking forward to meeting you someday.